Hello dear students, welcome to Devika's Commerce and Management Academy. Uh, so, today we will see mode in discrete series, but here today's problem we are going to see bimodal method. Bimodal method means through grouping analysis table also when you cannot define mode, when you cannot trace out mode, then we have to go for bimodal method means we have to use another formula. So, that is mode is equal to 3 median minus 2 mean. Just wait, do not worry. Now, see the problem through the problem you will get more clarity. Now, here the problem from the following data find mode. So, the problem is given like this. Only this is the problem given x and frequency. Now, in frequency what is the highest data? 51 is 51 means 50 is repeating 51 times highest generally in previous classes by inspection mode lies in uh, 50 because 50 repeated 51 times we could have said. But if you see the next highest number is 48 which is very much nearer to the 51 that is why always we have to prepare the grouping analysis table. How to prepare the grouping analysis I taught you in the previous class. So, I am not going to teach you, I just have drawn already grouping analysis table. Okay? So, this is grouping table and analysis table. You know that 6 columns are there, first column as it is, second column 2 2 numbers we have added, third column we left the first number added 2 2 numbers, fourth column 3 numbers added, fifth, fifth column left the first number and added 3 3, sixth column we left the first 2 number added 3 3. Like this we have prepared the grouping table, highest number we have identified 51, 78, 99, 123, here 87 highest, 87 is the only number, so this is this has repeated twice, so that is why we have rounded both, both 87. Now in uh, sixth column 129, this is grouping table, then after that we will be preparing the analysis table, analysis table whichever highest is there, for that we have given mark. So, in the first column 51, 51 means 50, 50. Second column, how do you got 78? By adding 30 and 48. So, 30 and 40, 30 and 40. So, here if you see grouping table, I have drawn this columns also, means in square, it will be easy, you will not get confused. Okay? Now, third column, how do you got? By leaving the first number added 3, 3, 2, 2. So, highest is 123. How do you got 123 by adding 48 and 51? Means 40 and 50. 40 and 50. Now, fourth column added 3, 3. So, highest is 123. How do you got these 3 is this one and uh, 30, 48 and 51 together 123. So, 30, 48, 51 means 30, 40, 50. 30, 40, 50. Sixth column, okay. Next, after that, left the first, uh, fourth column is added 3, 3, no? So, these 3, 40, 50, 60. Which column I am talking? Fourth column, yeah, 40, 50, 60. Sixth column, did you remember, did you get it? Fourth column is here, 123 we got. 123 means by leaving the first one, these 3, okay. So, that we have identified. Now, sixth column, we got 87 twice. So, how do you got 87? By leaving the first number, these three we have added, means 20, 30, 40. 20, 30, 40 and this one we got 40, 50, 60, these three numbers together, okay? 40, 50, 60 also, okay? 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, these three we have added, okay? Now, next one, sixth column, 129. How, how, how do you got 129? By leaving the two numbers, means 30, 40, 50. 30, 40, 50. So, analysis table is ready. Now, if you see the analysis table, the score 20 got 1, 30, 3, 45, 50 also 5. Now, highest number is here, 5, twice it has come. If it is 4 and if it is 5, we could trace out easily mode. Now, when it is like this, we cannot trace out the, we cannot find out the mode. 
that is why we say it as a bimodal. We can write one sentence here. Mode is unable to, to trace. Trace as per the grouping analysis table. Grouping and analysis table. Hence, it is a bimodal method. It is a bimodal. Bimodal method means we have to use one formula. What is the formula? Where is the sketch? So, in bimodal method, we use one formula. Mode is equal to or Z is equal to 3 median minus 2 mean. Remember this formula 3 median minus 2 mean means we have to find out the median and mode, median and mean x bar and median both we have to find out. What is the series? Individual series sorry discrete series. Discrete series did you remember how to find out the x bar and mean median? So, immediately we have to do. So, what should I do? Should I clean this area to find out median and x bar? Have you noted? If you want you can note down. Take a screenshot. Okay, I will clean this part. You have to write this. Mode is unable to trace as per the grouping analysis table. Hence, it is a bimodal method. Okay. Shall we write the data once again? X and frequency 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. And frequency is here 4, 9, 30, 48, 51, 24, 12, 2. For calculation of X bar x bar how do you get x bar formula simple method you can go sigma fx by n this is the formula sigma fx by n means f into x we have to multiply okay so this total is you know n is 180 okay now fx will calculate it 10 into 4 40 40 20 into uh, 9, 180, 1 minute, 40, 180 and 30 into 30, uh oh, 30 into 30, 900. 40 plus 180 plus 900 plus 40 into 48, 40 into 48, 1920, 50 into 51, 2, and then 16 to 17 to 12, 840, 18 to 20 that is 160, this total is 5480. Now we will apply in the formula sigma fx is 5480 divided by n, n is 180 divided by uh, 180 we will check out the calculations once again there might be some mistake uh, 20 into 9 180 13 to 
थर्टी नाइन हंड्रेड फोर्टी इंटू फोर्टी एट नाइनटीन ट्वेंटी फिफ्टी इंटू फिफ्टी वन टू थाउजेंड फाइव फिफ्टी करेक्ट सिक्सटी इंटू ट्वेंटी फोर फोर्टीन फोर्टी एंड सेवेंटी इंटू टूवल एट फोर्टी एटीन टू टू वन सिक्सटी द टोटल इज एट जीरो थ्री जीरो दिस कैलकुलेशन सर करेक्ट बट दिस वन एट जीरो थ्री जीरो एट जीरो थ्री जीरो डिवाइडेड बाई वन एटी दिस फोर्टी फोर पॉइंट सिक्स वन फोर्टी फोर पॉइंट सिक्स वन This is eight zero three zero. So x bar we got it. Now next what else? Median. In discrete series, what is the formula? Median is equal to size of n plus one by two item. Did you remember? Individual discrete series median formula is this one. First, what do we need to do for CF? cumulative frequency whether it is a uh, discrete series or continuous series first step to find out the median is preparing the cumulative frequency cf so let's prepare the cf this is 4 4 plus 9 13 13 plus 30 43 43 plus uh, 48 means uh, this is 11 91 91 plus 51 2 142 One forty-two plus twenty-four. This is six, and six one sixty-six. Am I right? Six is yeah. One sixty-six plus twelve. One seventy-eight and one eighty. Yes, correct. Now size of n plus two thigh term. It lies n plus two. N is here one one eighty. One eighty plus one by two. One means one eighty one, one eighty one divided by two. It is ninety one ninety point five. Ninety point five. Ninety point five means it lies here. Just above ninety point five. Cumulative frequency is ninety one. So median is here forty. Ninety point five lies in C of ninety one. Hence. Median is equal to is equal to how much forty? Okay, we got median and uh, arithmetic mean. So we'll apply in the formula. So z is equal to mod is equal to. I need not to write the formula. Three into median. Three into three into median is forty. Three into median. Minus two into x bar. X bar is forty four point six one. Let's do the calculations. Three into forty means one twenty. One twenty minus forty four point six one into two. Or we can take forty four rather than six. Uh, this we can take it as a forty five also. Nearest rupee, so forty-five. Forty-five into forty-five, forty-five into two comes to ninety. So Z will be here thirty. That's all. Once again, let me explain. As per the grouping analysis table, mode we could not we could not trace out. We could not find out the mode. So whenever through grouping analysis table, when you cannot find out mode, that is bimodal method. Bimodal method. In bimodal method, we have to use another formula that is three median minus two mean. Three median minus two mean means median and mean we have to find out. This is discrete series, right? So discrete series. Mean? How do you find out sigma f x by n? Sigma f x total, okay, by n. So that you got 
x bar 45 and median always you have to go for first cf cf means 4 as it is 4 plus 9 13 like we have gone for cf calculation then after that you know the formula size of n plus 1 by 2th item discrete discrete individual series size of n plus 1 by 2th item only in continuous series size of n by 2 no plus 1 ok. So, as per that 90.5, 90.5 it lies here. So, median is 40. So, we have written that median is 40. When we got uh, mean, median, apply in the formula. So, z is equal to this is 3 median minus 2 mean, 3 median 40 minus 2 mean 2 into 45. So, you got more like this. Am I clear? Now, there is nothing to worry mode generally we can uh, go for by inspection by inspection is whenever there is a lot of gap suppose this is 51 but this is 40 or 30 somewhere next highest number by inspection you can go not required to go for grouping analysis table and this by model method nothing is required but whenever you find near to the highest number next highest is near you have to prepare the grouping analysis table through grouping analysis table when you can trace out what is mode that's over problem is over but in this problem what happened we could not trace out the mode through the grouping analysis table both the numbers got the same number highest number got it when you cannot trace out we have to say it as a this is bimodal method hence mode can be calculated through mode is equal to 3 median minus 2 mean this formula you have to write and go for the calculation of median and mean easy nothing to worry we know all the calculations simply you have done the calculations then applied in the formula that is it am I clear the same pattern will have even a disc continuous series also and the discrete or continuous series pattern is same only formulas will be changing because this is discrete and future will next problems will be continuous series problem formulas will be changing but pattern is same. Are you clear? If you are clear, then we can go for the further classes. By the way, check out the playlist. Whatever subjects you want, you can just use it and get the good marks, practice well. Do not forget to share this video. See you in the next class. Good luck.